there. Welcome to Xtrue Design. Today we will talk about sections in Creo. Let's get started. Go to View Ribbon, Sections. First, Planner Section. In Reference tab, we need to define the section reference. After that, there are two options available, first one is true, second one is offset. This is capped section option. This will allow us to make the solid body into a surface body. This is the section color. This color will be applied on the section surfaces. This is hatching. This is dragger, which will allow us to translate and rotate the clipping plane's orientation. This is, 2D view of cross section in a separate window. Next, in Model tab, we can actually include a particular component in sectioning or exclude a components in sectioning. For multiple selection, Use control button in your keyboard. In options tab, there is a show interference feature, which will show the interfered portions in the assembly. Actually, we can check the interfered portions in the entire assembly. To do this, activate the 2D view feature. Use the dragger to check the interfered portions. That's it. Now, we are done with planner section. Next, XYZ direction sections. These are default sections on XYZ planes. Coming to offset sections. It requires a sketch. I am defining my sketch here.
where I need to include the keyway and the one of the fasteners in my section. This is the offset command. Zone section. This zone section is used to insert the 3D sections view in Creo drawing. See the arrows direction. Add multiple zones by adding sections. The plus sign will add new section zones. Create a new drawing. View set up for the planar view. View set up for the offset view. In offset view, there is a full aligned option and a full unfold option. The full aligned feature requires a center axis. Select the center axis for the reference. The full unfold option is not activated, because this view is a projection. In projection view this feature will be disabled. In general view only, this will be enabled. Now 3D section view. In 3D cross section, the zone sections will be appear. Select the defined zone section. That's all about the sections in Creo. Thanks for watching.